Good day my friends and how you all doing today? This is Moral Truth here and welcome to another video. So for today we are going to be checking out the journey of the moon, Muna 500k subs project by Moonafic Archive, the same folks who put together the Lunar Memories, the Muna birthday project video. I really enjoyed that project and I'm really looking forward to checking out this one. And it's amazing that Muna reached 500k subscribers sometime back. It is really amazing that these folks put together this little project to celebrate this milestone. So yeah, without further ado, let's go ahead and get into it. So we start off with Muna reaching out for the door. She looked like she's about to cry. It was like, wow, literally so much emotion in this. The night sky is like really amazing. Wow. I wonder what Moon is thinking about. Oh, that smile. He's about to open a gateway to somewhere. I wonder where. Moon is debuted on April 11th, 2020. There's already like almost a year already. Like, wow. We got some ASMR going on here. Good evening, Muna. Good evening. <laughs> Even though she had technical difficulties during her debut stream, she didn't let that be her during the stream. Wow. Yeah, Lirin is having problems. Yep. I'm gonna tell you about my dream. My dream? Yeah, Muna's dream. Of dreams. Yeah, look at all these dreams Muna had. Like, uh, she really reached 100k, and yeah, she really did like collabs as well. And it's like amazing, like yeah. for real. But yeah, she did like experience technical difficulties on her debut, but that didn't stop her at all, like for real. Muna 3D, that'd be really amazing. Simuda could dance. Yeah. And then. That'd be awesome. A Muna star. That'd be really nice. That, that That's really like a wholesome dream right there. So, basically, in if you donate me something. Yeah, let's donate Muna a moon. <laughs> Sorry, let's donate Muna a star. <laughs> that works too. <laughs> Yeah, give her a moon. And then, <laughs> I want to have a Hololife concert. Hololife concert. concert. When I saw the Firebird Indonesia. cover, that literally looked like a concert right there. But having it as a 3D concert, that'd be pretty dope too. I want to sing with my friends. That would be awesome, like for play, real. Uh, I want to play with uh, like for real. any other YouTuber. I want to do a collab with Hololife. Yeah, the collab or, that Muna um, did with Pecora. That was, that, was, that was really like amazing like seriously like the whole hey muna memes that was that was amazing april 14th a few days after her debut stream muna uploaded her apology for technical difficulties oh yeah i remember this <laughs> yeah they showed this clip in the lunar memories video too yeah shout out to whoever put these translations like for real they're a real one yeah, it's not Muna's fault. <laughs> I agree, it was not Muna's fault. On May 13, Muna had her first collaboration with a senpai. Muna and Roboga stream Apex Legends and so on and so forth. I can't read that fast if you can clearly tell that. Oh my gosh. Hello. Hello. It's Roboko. Hey. Yeah, she was playing uh, Apex with uh, Roboko. I can relate to this on so many levels. My internet is literally so bad. That's pretty much why I can't stream. <laughs> what should I do, senpai? What should she do? Ah. Uh, <laughs> on June 11th, Ritsu stole Muna's piggy bag during the Area 15 stream on June 15th. <laughs> I can't read that fast. I'm sorry. Oh, I remember this clip. I remember. Yeah, Ritsu took uh, Muna's piggy bag and then I was like, like a piggy bag ASMR. I remember this clip. It, it was it was so funny. It was really nice ASMR though. It was really nice. 
Yeah, Moody's like, what? Wait a minute. My piggy bag is in here? Oh, yeah, now the chats are like telling her. Oh, wait. I think Rizu has your piggy bag. Uh oh. Uh oh, that's not good. I don't even recall what game she was playing though, but. Yeah. Yeah, Risu, what did you do other than taking piggy banks from a moon goddess? I feel I'm getting scanned. Oh yeah, the Area 15 um, streams are pretty dope when you have all three of the first gen of um, Hollow Life Indonesia. Pretty dope. Yeah, bye. This is dangerous. Uh-oh. You telling me, Yofi? Something's dangerous. I don't know what's coming. My purpose was to sign up as an idol. But turns out I signed up to become a stand-up comedian. <laughs> then she's surprised by my amount of support she received via membership. Oh, that, that's really amazing. Like, all these folks are showing their love and support um, for Muna by joining membership. That's really amazing, for real. But yeah, Muna is not just an idol. She's a stand-up comedian. <laughs> Yeah, and and Bekora, you know, she's the same way, and so that's why their collab is amazing. Time for growth for Armuna. Oh yeah, I've seen that growth. It's really amazing. On August 16th, the celebration of Indonesian Independence Day, Muna received her first new outfit. Oh yeah, yeah, I remember that outfit. That was truly an amazing outfit. She still uses it in her streams, so... Yeah, it's really like elegant and it really fits her theme. On September 21st, Muna played Minecraft, a new favorite game. A chance encounter led to extortion and in the start of an unexpected friendship. On October 14th, Muna joins Usada Kenseksu. Uh, it's basically the Pekora construction uh, business thing. And that's the collab I was talking to you folks about. About the Muna Pekori collab. Oh, you got the Yagu face. That still looks so cursed, but yeah, it's so funny. The cursed Yagu face. Oh yeah, Bekora stand-up comedian too. I, lo I love both of them. Yes, Bekora still here with the rabbit. Yes, of course. Why would she leave? Why would she though? I don't even know why she's staring at Bekora. Wow. <laughs> Wow. Thank you, one four. <laughs> oh, that's cute. Oh, Kensetsu. I don't even know if I pronounced that correctly. Kens Kensetsu. Kensetsu? Oh, joining uh, Pekora Construction? Hey, Muna. Hey, Muna. Oh my gosh. <laughs> the chorus is amazing. Hey Muna! Hey Muna! Hey Muna. <laughs> I think you're just like a meme at this point, like for real. She's the chief now of, of this uh, construction company. Days later, Muna streamed in her car and then her desktop is unusable. Oh my god, that's pretty base right there. Like, she's streaming in her own car. Oh my god. Can't meet her mother and her brother. Wow. I can't touch them. I cannot talk them. Oh no. That's so sad. But she's alone in this car, but not really because she has the Munafix with her. I don't know what I should do today, but you know, I'm just vibing anyways. <laughs> oh, yes, it's crashing and everything got all wrong. No, it's just a song at this point. Like, that just goes to show you she is a stand up comedian after all. It's not my Wi Fi, it's not my internet again. I can relate on so many levels. But right now, it's not even my laptop anymore. It's just my internet being suckish, you know? <laughs> oh, Namuna like. Next is Moon. Wait, I forgot what I forgot what uh, stream is this. I forgot. It was like some... Um, 
some Hollow Life games or something that had took place in Minecraft. Okay. <laughs> something like that. Hey, she had fun, you know. That, that's all that matters. Everybody looked like they had fun. Look at all, look at all the Hollow Life girls right there. Yeah, I see everybody right there. I see Eofi really closer. Great cute moon. She is in the chat show. What do you mean, Pekko? <laughs> On November 29th, Moon shows her concerns about doing the official collaboration with Pekora. Worried about the language barrier. Oh, yeah. Actually, this is the collab I was talking about. Yeah, because before, you know, Moon was just, um, like, chatting, like, typing. But they didn't actually do a collab yet. Oh yeah, well, this was the Yofi's idea to do the collab, the legendary collab. That would be great though, and they did. Don't be shy, come on. You offer, right? Can you just ask her? Like, ha actually have a collab? Yes, exactly, Yofi. You tell her. Very happy. On December 1st, in the long away collaboration, Clara lets Moon know she reached uh, 300k. Oh yeah, the Pecora English is, is is funny. Yeah, I mean it's it's hilarious. I I love Pecora's English. And during that collaboration, Muna hit 300k subs. And that that's amazing. Yeah, especially during this legendary collab, like for real. Like she hits like another amazing milestone, like for real. <laughs> yes, yes. 13 million. Was it actually 13 million? How much was it? <laughs> oh my god. 3,000k? 3, 3, <laughs> oh my god. 3,000k? Isn't that 3 million? <laughs> oh my gosh. Muna as a senpai. Collaboration with the Nyori sisters. Oh yeah, all three of them look alike. I can't even tell each of them apart. Oh my gosh, what just happened here? This blew up a house? What the heck happened? Oh again, maybe we got the Muna collab with uh, Rainnet. Oh, that was nice too. The pay will be put directly to the bank. Alright. Oh no! <laughs> so that is how to cook a peacock. That's how you cook a peacock. Oh my god! <laughs> wow! Let's I don't know if that's a pro gamer mood or not. Oh my gosh! Cook chicken! Yeah! Okay, Muna got cooked turkey then. Muna reaching 100k subscribers. I cannot say that I failed. Oh yeah, that was that was really a wholesome moment. Cause she really reached like. An epic milestone right there. You know, because of that, because of the stream, my debut, my debut stream, I got, I got my true... Yeah, I got the true fans from the debut, like with the whole technical difficulties. And the true viewers, the true listeners are called the Moonafics. And I'm happy to call myself a Moonafic as well, you know? Yeah, Muna does stream a lot. I've seen her recently uh, stream Apex. You know that I stream a lot, right? Yeah, absolutely. Because I'm thinking that I'm not... I'm not... Oh, no, no, don't say that, Muna. You've been amazing all this time. Like, come on. Don't say that. Sometimes I do feel that I'm not good. I, so, I know, but, you know, you, like, sometimes you do get that feeling that you're not doing enough. It's like I imposter syndrome right I there, make, but... I make him be a better stream by streaming more. Yeah, I, I can relate. I feel like I, I'd be a better, you know, VTuber, you know, if I, like, put out more content, you know? No, but you gotta remember, like, to take breaks and not work too hard, you know? Don't push yourself over the limit. To be honest, I am a perfectionist. I am a perfectionist, and I have, I do have... I am to, to an extent as well, like, for sure. I can be a perfectionist sometimes, too. And, yeah, I OCD a bit, too, you know? Like, you gotta make sure things are perfect, but, you know, at the same time, you know, I try to, like, just roll with whatever I have, you know? Just roll with it. And that's what she did on her debut, too. 
she just rolled with it with her DB despite the technical difficulties. Hey, much props to her, you know, for still continuing this journey in, in Hot Live Indonesia, like for real. And you know, like we even got the, and we even got the original song that Muna did. It was really an amazing original song. Like I really loved it a lot. Right now, I'm still surviving. I got the one. Yeah, Muna is still surviving even now, even at way after you know getting 100k. Like she even put out an original song, and I was almost in tears after I heard it. Like absolutely. Yeah, and I love how she's very, like, loving and appreciative of her fans, like, for real. She has so much loving fans, like, for real. We even got fans who take the time to make projects like these, like, you know, shout out to Munafic Archive channel, like, for real. Like, shout out to them. Yeah, there's some haters and out there, but, you know... You know, the negativity gets overpowered by all the positivity, you know, that Muna gets from the Munafix, like, for real. Yeah, mistakes happen, they're just part of the learning experience and you just gotta move on through it, you know? You can't even count it. <laughs> but we're still here, yeah, we're, oh, absolutely, we'll still be here to support you, Muna, absolutely. Yeah, much love, like, seriously, much love to Muna. Like, seriously, much love. Nothing but love here. No, don't cry. It'll make me cry, too. Congratulations on reaching 500k, Muna. Your Manafics have been watching you grow ever since you debuted in April. You have inspired us, too. The journey we have been on been has been nothing shy of eventful. And through the good times and the difficult times, you kept going and never gave up, you know? Much love to Muna as well. You will continue to walk through this journey with her. Absolutely. Much love. All right, my friends. So what are my thoughts on the journey of the moon, the Muna 500k subs project? Well, it's really amazing to see all these different highlights of Muna and pretty much starting off from her first debut stream, you know, when she experienced all the technical difficulties. And from there, you know, hitting all these milestones, doing all these different collabs and seeing Muna getting all this love and support from her fans, it, it really touches my heart because all the love and support from her fans, that pretty much keeps her going. And I'm happy that Muna didn't quit after her debut. She just kept going, you know, she just rolled with it. And she didn't quit, you know, when she decided to do a live stream in her own car. She didn't give up from there. Like she's very persistent when it comes to putting out content. And I respect her a lot for that, like seriously. Yeah, you know, from doing the Pecora collab and Minecraft to collabing with Raina on Minecraft to also even putting out an original song, you know, her very first original song that was not even a meme one, you know, it was like an actual original song and it really like almost made me cry, you know, I still listen to it like several times and yeah, it is really amazing to see how far Muna has gone ever since her debut. It's already been almost a year since she debuted, like seriously, time nearly flies by fast, like absolutely. Yeah, that's pretty much my thoughts on this 500k subs project for Muna. Like, it's really nice to see, like, all these different clips, all these different highlights. It was really nice to see the subtitles in the video as well. You know, that does take up a lot of work to have, like, all these clips translated to English. You know, that way I can actually understand, you know, what's going on, what's being said, etc, etc. And yeah, you know, shout out to Munafic Archive and everybody who is involved in making this project possible. And I'm looking forward to seeing Muna Hoshinova grow even further and further, even to the point where maybe one day, just one day, she will hit that 1 million subscribers. And I'm looking forward to seeing when that happens. And yeah, with well, that said, that concludes the reaction video. If you enjoyed, feel free to leave the video a like, subscribe for more if you have not already, and turn on the notification bell so you can stay notified on my future content. And with that said, this is Moral Truth. You take care. Have a great rest of your day or your evening. And let the morals be with you.